Hi guys, my name is Annie. I hope you all have a great day so far. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm doing DIY sewing. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to see new video every third day. In video today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys how to sew a mini skirt with full lining and invisible zipper. Actually, I already said you the way to sew a mini skirt last year. I will link it over here and also at the description box. This skirt will be similar with last skirt but different at the waistband. This kind of mini skirt fit with my hip and short enough. It's helped me sew up my body and lengthen, lengthen my uh, leg. <laughs> How do you like it? And let's tie up. Okay, let's get started. I beat up a kind of felt cloth fabric in brown. This fabric is quite thick, but soft and silky. And I'm going to use a time of polyester fabric for lining part in very light brown. For the border, I'm going to use the last pattern again because they are absolutely similar with each other just different to the waist pen this time i'm not separate the skirt and the waist pen then i'm gonna create a new pattern adding the waist pen like this And this skirt got two pockets at the back side. Okay, let's cut our fabric. Now, I'm starting to stick the waist dart on front side and also back side. When finished stitching, remember leave a distance of thread and tie it up to close it. Next, I'm working with the pocket. I will fold the top of it to the wrong side and stitch in by my hand. And I also stitch the seam allowances by hand to keep them in place. Then I'm going to play it on the back side at the position that I want, pin them in place and stitch in my sewing machine. After that, I'm gonna take out these pins and clean the pocket by unstitching the thread that I hand stitched before. Now, I'm gonna place two panels of back side on the front side with right side together and stitching both sides by sewing machine.
Moving on to the lining part, I will separate the waistband and the skirt like the last skirt. For the waistband, I'm gonna use the felt cloth fabric. And, and the length of the lining part is shorter 3 cm than the main part. Like the main part, I'm also stitching the waist start first. Then, I'm going to stick both sides together, but at one side, I will leave a hole to work in with it after. For the waistband, I also connect both sides together. Now, I pin the waistband into the lining skirt and stitching them together. Remember grab the seam to flat and nice, but I wanna make sure the voice pan of skirt look more beautiful, so I'm gonna understick on the voice pan of lining part right beside the seam. Next, I already prepared two small panels of felt cloth fabric with 4 cm width to make it the bell hook. Now, I'm going to fold it like this and stitch it on two sides of it. After that, I'm gonna cut them into 4 pieces with 8cm length for it. Now, I'm going to stick one side of bell hook into the main skirt like this. Next step, I'm working with the invisible zipper. You need to chain an invisible foot before sewing. I will carefully pin one side of zipper into one side of box skirt and stitch them together. And do it the same with the other side. Oh, see, the invisible zipper part is really nice and beautiful. Next, I'm going to connect two panels of back skirt in one, from the end of the zipper to the bottom. Then, I'm going to throw my hand between the main skirt and lining part to grab the invisible zipper with lining part out, then stitching them together.
After that, turn the right side out. Especially, try to pull the corner out how to look nice and beautiful. And now, I'm working with the bottom of skirt. I'm going to put my hand through the hole on lining part and pull the bottom of lining part and the main skirt out and stick them, them together by my sewing machine. When finished sewing, I'm gonna turn the right side out and stitching this hole to close it and press the bottom to flush and nice. And remember to stick to finish the bell hook. To make in the belt, I prepare a felt cloth fabric pieces with 10 cm width. Now I will fold it and stitch it by my sewing machine. Next, I just cut the extra fabric at the corner and turn the right side out. I also press it to flat and nice. And then I'm gonna stitch in around on the right side a bit. I already prepared this thing, but I don't know how to name it. I bought it at the sewing accessory shop. Now I'm going to put the strap through it and stitch it to close. And I got a belt. Very simple, right? And here's the final result. I love it. Actually love it. It fits with my body really well. And I love the belt. It's just simple but very unique detail. Hope you like it. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you next time. Bye.